Satan, the Judeo-Christian prince of darkness, he is known for his role as the snake that tempted Adam and Eve into Eden. It is also said that he was sent by God to test man's piety. Ladies and gentlemen, meet my level 99 persona, Satan. Look at this guy. He is crazy looking. Hey, hey guys, the K78 back here with more Persona 5 Royale. In the last one, we started out in Mementos and did a lot of things. And now, we're going to finish it up, hopefully, in this episode. It has been a quite a strange journey here so far. Our goal is to get to the top, I guess. We're not really going down. Oh, no, not you. Why you of all things? You! All right, well, let's meet Satan here and give it some abyssal surge. Oh, no, wait, we're not on Satan. We're on the other thing that I couldn't beat in the palace, and then I decided to fuse it anyways. Uh, does wind affect this thing? All right, uh, you freeze it. I'm pretty sure I could fuse this thing somehow. I just don't have the ingredients for it, I suppose. Side eye. Electrocute this stupid thing. Alright. Uh, Deadly Fury. Get out of here, you stupid thing. Jesus. The people don't want to see that. The first thing they do when they okay. open up the episode. <laughs> um, anyways. So, we're supposed to be going up because of the fact that's the way that this is set up. Um, you know, it's technically deep in mementos past the, uh, Holy Grail. It's kind of crazy if you think about it. Also, is this just me? Or is this from, like, feel like sand? Like, I could imagine Joker walking around barefoot and it'd be feeling like sand of all things. Even though the rest of the place is clean. Sand just feels comfortable in your feet sometimes. Although, then it gets a little hard to clean off. When you go back to the car and go home after Whoa, a while. I'm not spotted. dealing with those things. Up, no. Oh, shoot. Oh, okay. That was my fault. No, I was running away and then I ran into a corner in the bad way. I think Joker's going to turn orange by the time this is done. Because I have to feed him another carrot. Alright. Everyone got level ups okay. out of that, which is nice. Uh, where's the carrot? There. Give me a carrot. Jesus Christ. Okay, anyways. Uh, you know, we were talking about lots of things. Did I finish my thought on costume in the last episode? I don't remember if I did. I think I was telling, uh, I was going to say, it's clever that, um, you can hide her name just because everyone uses the last name as usual, uh, in Japan. That's what I was going to say. It's pretty cool that you can hide that. She's really Sumire instead of Kasumi. Yeah, he does. Uh, talk to Jose. There I go. Hey. Remember how I told you I just couldn't bring myself to like the flowers here? Yeah, what about it? Well, I think I know why now. Enlighten me. The flowers here taste sort of staticky. I don't really like it. Like they're fake. Since these flowers are... Hmm. How to phrase it like someone in the real world... Ah, right. It's the cognition of oneself, which everyone has inside themselves. When the flavor gets staticky, like with these, that means the self is uncertain of its own cognition. Huh. Can people really not know what they are? Is everyone like that? There are people like that, yes. we already seen that. I don't get it. This is nothing like what I've been taught. But I can't quit my studies now. Oh, even Jose is unsure. How Hi. rude of Maruki to do this. <laughs> I don't have much with you, actually, so I'm gonna back out of that. I just needed you for safety. And 
going, keep going. Oh, not that way though. <laughs> I should probably beat up more of the enemies because then I can get more levels and that way I won't be super under leveled in the later parts of the dungeon. Oh my goodness, what is this? Give me this, give me this, give me this. Give it to me, thank you. Oh, it's a regent. Really? Really? Of all things, it's a regent. Yeah. Nice. It's not like I can tell the difference until I get into a battle, but okay. Jesus, man. I was excited, and now I just got a stupid low leveled enemy from Kamashita's palace. Way to bring my hopes up. Alright, I need to go, like, this way. Oh, there's a treasure chest here. I'm pretty sure the mo it hasn't mentioned whether or not the Reaper could come down here, but I'm pretty sure he still exists down here. Mark, you probably brought him in to be like, okay, let's make sure these guys aren't being stupid like that. Nice. Let's go. Thank you. The top of those what's up. She changed the position to make sure I kept the video going. <laughs> yeah, level 81. Step oh man, I'm so close to being level 99. It would be cool if I could be level 99 down here. And uh, I'm gone. Anyways, uh, um, pretty sure Maruki brought down the Reaper here because he wanted to make sure that we were kept going toward the goal, so it would help me do that if I actually, like, kept going. Oh, also, I need a heal box. I did not realize he was that low on health. Uh. Oh, crap, we've been spotted. Let's do this. Uh. Let's see. I hope I'm going the right. Oh. Hey, they lost me. Nice. Oh. Perma pick. What am I going to do with those 15 lockpicks? <laughs> I should probably sell them if I can. If I can sell the lockpicks. I don't think I could sell thief tools though. Huge gold lump. Uh, don't go that way. You Hi guy. Beat him. Or we could just uh, run away like a wimp. Oh. Open this door and then we go through so we can get away from that enemy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I don't think I'm allowed to uh, keep that in the recording. <laughs> Keeps it in recording, anyways. I don't know. Uh... Alright, let's go up. 15. Oh, we're still not done yet? Aw, oh, man. How big is this place? I thought it would be done by 15. Oh. Hi. I'm curious. Are you the guy that I made? No. However, you are the guy that will die to Abysmal Surge. If it hits. And then we just heal up. There we go. Okay, let's move on. Nice. Okay. <laughs> no match for me. I would imagine he isn't a match for you. Uh, I don't have that many flowers for him, so let's skip out on Jose for now and go up. Uh, let's see. There's a lot of chains in here. Enemy ahead. Be careful. No, nope, nope. Oh, well, There's we'll get chest. the treasure chest instead. Let's open it. Or I could back attack you. Haha, -ha, that was my plan all along. Well, on to the next trial. Okay, let's move on. <laughs> okay. I seriously don't like that combination at all. Of the. They're all just. <sighs> why? Just why? I know this game is rated M for Mature, but still. You didn't need to put it in your face. Oh well, anyways. 
Um. Hmm. Oh, another level. Okay. Alright. I'm gonna bet it's 20 then. 20? 20? Oh my goodness, what the heck? I think we found it. Well, we found it. What is this? The radio tower of some sort? Cognitive control room. Whoa. this place there's tons of computery stuff all over this is the central data lit hub this room is most likely where the data gets sent over from the, from the palace hey hey what's that on the screen various locations within mementos i presume this is about this less about the surveillance and more looking for targets though targets think about it while all sorts of unnatural events may be taking place in Maruki's reality, that doesn't mean every human's wish has been granted already. That's a good point! If everyone's wishes were already made into reality, there wouldn't be any requests on the fan site. Yes. Exactly. Therefore, Maruki is likely choosing certain targets with this system, then affecting each one individually. Probably using the same method as when he made Violet's persona go berserk that one time. Huh? What? Me? From what I remember, Dr. Maruki summoned these things that looked like tendrils, and they grabbed me. Wait, don't tell me. Are these? They look like tendrils to me. Indeed. These are not... These are the something Dr. Maruki is using to affect the minds of others, such as Violet, for example. Hmm. Yes. That hypothesis explains much of what we've seen. If we, if we're to be true, Maruki is extending these cables from his own palace, tunneling into the depths of mementos, and spreading his influence from the same place the Holy Grail once occupied. That allowed him to grant the wishes of any people he might, he may discover once they've fallen under his influence. <laughs> Psh, screw that. Mm -hmm. This, but this won't last much longer now that we're here. Okay, but I'm the one who has to do the actual hacking, though. Access by consultation subject confirmed. Temporarily suspend research data stream? Huh? huh? What's that supposed to mean? Well, the displays are all showing parts of mementos, right? I guess we can suspend something here? Uh... Gotta try to find out. True that. You got it! I like the way you think. Okay, so we got rid of the tentacles. Research data stream suspended, retracting pipelines to resume data streaming. What? Yeah, go ahead and shut up now. We ain't resuming shit. Does this mean we're any closer to stopping Maruki? Mm. All we did was suspend the data sharing. Stopping Maruki is a whole other story. I don't think this will interfere with its effect on mementos. Sorry. What? Then what does good to suspending the data stream do to us? According to this console's output, all cable tendrils are retracted now. Possibly including some place in the palace that was blocked before. We won't know until we check it out for ourselves. What say we head to the palace next? Yeah, we've done what we can here. Next on our agenda, a return to Maruki's palace. Uh... Huh. Okay. Yo, know, it's interesting that, uh, that you did that, but there's no boss fight to protect this place or anything. Hmm. Oh, looks like one of those camps. Like, but looks like those cables went away after we cut off the data transfer. We should be able to get past that one spot in the palace Let's now. Go. Okay. Well then. Uh. I'm detecting. 
expecting more sh Uh, we can go higher. Oh wait, going higher does this. Do we want to stay here? I don't think we need to. I mean, as much as I want to grind some more, I think we're good, actually. So let us get out of here. And did I pick up any more personas? Only this guy. I'm not sure if I want to continue fusing personas. I think we're good, actually. So let us leave. What do you want to do? We did everything we needed to. Want to call it a day? Sure. Now returning from Mementos. Thank you for our hard work. I am deeply surprised that uh, we did not have to fight anything. Hmm. The mom made a post on the fan site. I guess she checked her history and found her daughter's post. She apologized for everything. They're taking a family trip to an amusement park, too. She sounds more coherent than before. I think it's all better. Glad that worked out. Yeah! I bet she got a nice big hug from her mom. I'm almost a little jealous. Uh, almost. <sighs> you think she'd be a little more honest with herself. But if you think about it, we never would have fixed this without Fataba. If we just passed this all off as a false alarm, who knows what a, how much the worse their lives would have gotten. Nice. Fataba picked up a cry for help. She was kind enough to fight for them. That's how we saved that family. The client who was asking to be killed took down the request. The siblings were going to die, were going to be separated, but his little sister spoke up. She was really against it, so the whole thing got caught off. Sometimes she's a little scared of him. Sometimes, but she still loves and appreciates him. Hey, that's pretty much saying that what the guy was saying in Mimanos. I guess that they really do have a sibling connection, huh? From now on, they'll be supporting each other. They'll get help from grown-ups if they need it. It's also moving. I'm glad we saved them. Yeah, seriously. I'm so glad he posted on the fan site. Anyways, nice work. Mm. They live up and living together. I can't tell you if it's a good idea or not, but as long as they can remember how much they care for each other, I think they'll be okay. Oh, another text. I saw the fan site. I'm glad this. I'm glad to see the change of heart helped things. Still, this request got me thinking about my own situation. He and his sister. They reminded me of the situation between Sis and I. I mean, she also kind of... Well, I don't, never mind. I don't think what you're feeling is wrong. I guess you're right. Thank you, Ren. <laughs> right, Makoto lives with her sister too. It's just the two of them there. I guess she's dealing with a lot herself. She's acknowledged her own conflicting feelings, huh? This request really made us think. Oh, my god. My butt phone is buzzing a lot. <laughs> I, can't, I can't believe what's become of Mementos. His power is truly tremendous. I didn't even think Mementos went that far down. This place is freaking huge. Far up, more like. I lost track of how long we spent on those stairs. I know, right? This place is not made for your gamer physique. Maybe it's obvious, but when your legs feel and get tired, stretching always helps. And it might be good to massage your pressure points, too. Whoa, the athlete knew their stuff. Speaking of, didn't you say you were going straight through a practice after this, Samiri? I'm actually about to straight my training, yes. How? Where does all that stamina even come from? Well, it's your call. Just don't go tiring yourself out. If you waste all of your energy in, out of combat, you're, just, you're not just useless. You're a liability. Then I'll make sure not to push myself too hard. Yep. Well, we'll have to get back to infiltrating the palace next time. I just hope our path isn't blocked. Beef stand updated. Okay, then. Um, well, we finished Sumeri's ranks, so we don't need to do that. Uh, I can't leave unless I get a massage. That's right. Let's do it. Get a massage from Kawakami. You're so stiff. Like right here. Master. <laughs> oh. See you later. Yep. Alright. Now yeah, then. Uh. I doubt you're still there. Oh, there's stuff I can, like, sell and figure out. I want to work on trying to 
get stuff. Do I have more money? Yeah, I do. So I could do this. And I mean, I could sell the stuff to him, but I think it's, uh... I think everyone's at, at better things. So I got some better stuff for the guys. I would sell the clothing, but I'm not sure if that's a good idea or if I should just launder it instead. Uh, it might be a good idea to have Kawakami do that for me. All right, we're going to... They're all tainted for gr with greed. Okay. Let's do one of each at least. Let's see if those are any good. Uh, let's do another guy's equipment. Wind wash. Kawakami. Nice. And then I'm going to go to EY's. And sell stuff. <laughs> uh, I want to shop, not work. No. I'm gonna get some medicines as well. I got more uh, stuff that takes off the regular stuff. Uh, I can't think of anything else to do. Sunday, so you would improve from the bathhouse. I guess I should probably go back to the airsoft shop and actually hang out with EY as a small hangout because it would help if I finished him at least. So work. Leave the shop to me. Hang out. I can invite him to the plant. Why would I want to do that? Do it. Just cuz. Hmm. Planetarium, huh? Yeah, Karu would like this place. It'd be educational, too. I wonder why kids get interested in stuff like stars in space. Man. It's all couples here. This ain't place for an old guy like me to stroll in with another guy. <laughs> <laughs> Technology these days is sure impressive. Barely understood what they were saying, though. I better educate myself before I break Karu here. Can you do... You want me to teach you? Eh, shut up. Yo. There's something I want to ask you. What would you say a good father's like? I never had someone like that, so I gotta figure out how to be a normal parent of co for Car. Ah, never mind. Ain't like me to talk about this crap. There are some families here, but it looks like they're with younger kids. I hope Caru still wants to come here. See ya. Nice. We hung out in the planetarium with EY. And we got a laundry. Hi. Nice. Sinful bikini, lucky underwear, bottomless scarf, old underwear. So I could put guys in their underwear. Too bad it's not really a costume, though. Hey. Ah, friend. Cold as always, isn't it? But I suppose that's part of the winter's charm. The air is so pure and crisp. There's a strange clarity to it all, as if everything suddenly brought into sharper focus both within and beyond ourselves. You okay? I wonder, I'm... There's no pressure, but can I see you again later, just whenever you have time? I'm in your Thanks. Death. I'll see you later. Yeah, I need to follow up with my party members, and I have not done that. <laughs> um... We should go talk to him. It's not going to force me, though. Anyways. Uh, let's see. That equipment that I just got. Was it any better? Oh, yeah. The lucky underwear is better. <laughs> Alright. You get the lucky underwear, then. Because it's men's printed underwear. Fills well with courage. Nice. <laughs> uh... Let's put... Oh, you could have the bottomless scarf. Those are good. Sinful bikini. Oh, goodness. Uh, sorry, on. 
Um, let's put... Let's put you in the old tights. I'm sorry, Ryuji. No one wants this old underwear at all, so... It don't work. Now I know that I actually do have good things on me to uh, spend with Kawakami to do. Anyways, in the next episode, I think I will go back and finish up Maruki's uh, palace. That way I could... Uh, that way I could send out the calling card soon and then maybe finish the stuff up, hopefully. Well, at least uh, finishing the palace will help. We'll see you guys then.